Twelve, Romans 12, 2. Be ye not conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewal of your mind, that ye may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God. Amen. Whenever you feel that you are overeating too much, remember 1 Corinthians 10, 31. First Corinthians 10 31 says, Whether therefore ye eat or drink, whatsoever ye do, do it all to the glory of God. Amen. And remember also what God says about sexual promiscuity and sexual accidents. First Thessalonians 4 3. Thessalonians 4 3. For this is the will of God, even your sanctification, that ye should abstain from fornication. But remember, you and members of the church as a whole, these bodies are ours, they do not belong to us. They are the Lord's, and we have a, 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 we have a goal to maintain that we must respect it and honor it. Well, not honor our bodies, but we must respect it and put in the good things that we want to come out of. In conclusion, I will read Proverbs 4, 25 to 27, which says, Let your eyes look straight forward ahead. Put your gaze directly before you. Make level paths for your feet, and take only ways that are firm. Do not stir up to the right or to the left. Keep your foot from evil. Amen. Amen.